my journey to find the perfect sound for me. I was always uh, struggling with the fact that I love to be a fretless player and on the other hand I'm a metal bass player. So you always have that difficult mix of uh, wanting to play sweet melodies and having a very warm sound and a very uh, direct sound and then you have uh, the heavy riffs where you want a very percussive sound, you want a heart attack, you want to have, I don't know, some dirt there. I use different pickups, I use different woods. Uh, just to get closer to that idea that I had in my mind. And I mean, even produces uh, hybrid basses where you have the bass half fretted and half fretless and that all helped, but I wanted to have a complete tonal range of six string bass and combine both worlds. smaller bass company produces uh, steel fretboards. I saw it in different guitarists in the scene that I appreciate that use steel fretboards. So I um, yeah, contacted Ivaness and talked with them about this idea. And I, to be honest, it's a huge company. I, I was not sure if they would pick up on that idea, but uh, as amazing as Ivaness is, they were very interested in an idea and they want to develop new techniques. I mean, you can check the, the workshop series from Ivaness. They are always open for bases that are not like the standard bases. Most other big companies, they produce like two or three series and they don't go left and right from there and they really stick with the thing. And Ivaness does very experimental uh, uh, bases and I love that about them. So they got in touch with different uh, experts in that field and uh, made a first prototype, a second prototype, and in the end we had this. Uh, I have this amazing result. One of the biggest challenges was to get the steel, which is a very solid material, on a very flexible material, which is wood. So it's basically like putting a truss rod outside on a base. They glued it together and made it dry by uh, putting uh, bicycle tubes around the neck. That was <laughs> an interesting technique to see. And I love that I got some pictures and some video material of the uh, yeah, making of this base. really the perfect instrument for me now and I have this percussive very crispy sound that's exactly what I had in mind and Ibanez uh, Germany and um, Woodwork Studio made a perfect job. Yeah. 